Guantanamera. Ai a Guantanamera. Ai a Guantanamera. Hey yo, what up, what up, what up? This is your boy Narito Kim. Hope you are doing really, 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 really good. Today we have a very, very beautiful tutorial. A very, very, very nice tutorial. Let me put my camera in good position like this one. Yeah, control, control. Look at me now. You see me good? All right. Uh, actually, uh, I've got my listening tutorial. Somebody they say like the red Kim, I want you to teach us how to use noise reduction. Yeah, I'm coming with that. And another thing is the red Kim, I want you to teach us how to create color grading from scratch. You know, I've I've been post a lot of tutorial that I'm doing color grading, but I'm using my loot package. If they like people, they be like, okay, the red Kim it's like you are <laughs> advertising your products some of us can never achieve uh, can never manage maintain to buy your loot to be honest this loot is very cheapest price and it's very helpful it's not like to using this loot is like you are doing a bad thing no it's a good thing and to know how to create a look for your own is also a good thing but it, this loot is giving you easy way to sting you know Instead of wasting time creating things like piano yeah, yeah, because all of those things that you're going to do, they, it will be the same. It will be the same. All right. So uh, today in this video, we're going to do a car grading from scratch. This footage, it's a Sony. It's a Sony camera. It's a wonderful. All right. Let's jump into the tutorial. Guantanamo. You know. You have to look good make sure you're looking good if you, even though you don't have anything to your pocket but you're looking smack <laughs> all right let's jump into the car grading all right now we are into da vinci resolve as you can see this footage we've been shot with a sony camera and the sony camera so what i'm about to do now is start into a car grading so when i look at this picture I really want something orange in tea look you know I really want if you see the picture totally you can f you can feel that uh, the overall picture you look at the same color it's a little bit red something like that but to me what I want is having red to the I mean warm to the uh, subject and have a coolness there and it's easier for me to get the coolness because the background a little bit off you know more than the subject so it's it's easy for me to get what i want so yeah but i'm going to use the dehancer <laughs> instead of doing a car space transformations because the answer is giving me a free print which is i love so yeah uh, okay i'm going to choose the camera this is a sony camera and it is alpha 3 and it was shot on s log 3 just like this all right to so my frame print i mean to the, my film this is a film print i'm gonna choose one of uh that i see working nice to me like this one you just uh you just try out Yeah, I kind of feel this one is fill. It's giving me enough saturation. And also, I love this Endura. In my recent tutorial, I explained about this. And then I'm going to uncheck the grains just like this. All right, so after doing so, to create a look for your own, the first thing you need, I always love using this type of uh, node tree one two three four and then make another period nodes which is i'm going to do the same thing one two three four after doing so i come in here make uh, a layer node sorry i did this i have to make a layer node i make a layer node which is going to help me doing a splitting it's going to juice my picture so here yeah. 
all right so this the middle notes i always do the contrast so you guys know about this i'll come here using my curve it just a slightly just a slightly contrast not too much a very slightly you see very slightly the first thing that's are starting is contrast after finish all the contrast what i'm going to do next is just uh, my primary tools so that uh, the picture is very shadow so i'm going to raise the lift and gamma a little bit to make it look brighter to clean that shadow super shadow and as well as the highlights i'm going to balance just something correcting yeah now it's looking good so this is before and this is after all right so after I finish or doing this what i'm about to do next is i'm going to do uh, uh i'm going to fix the white balance so i'm going to drag down the picture until i see it's getting perfect balance just like this i love this one this is before this is after i took down those cool um, i mean those warm and i mean those red and uh magenta it was a marine magenta but the magenta is look like filming you know a little bit all right so i'm going to increase the saturations here here the picture how it look don't worry don't worry everything is going to be settled all right so after doing the saturation i'm coming here this note this upper note here is where i do my correction and this is the correction that i've done from uh from this to be this you see so the down here the uh sub period is i mean the the period notes here is where i creating my look so instead of me using these four notes i can just only using single notes to apply loots but today i know they apply loots today i'm going to do my own creating the look for my own and this is what i'm doing <laughs> this is what i always do creating my look so yeah you just watch the way i do it all right so to create a look uh, what i'm going to do exactly is here is a problem. A lot of beginners they struggling how to make color grading as pro level. YouTube itself can never pull up to that level. Director Kim came out with the massive masterclass phase one and phase two, which is the phase one has three parties and each of her parts has long pause video. Having an issue with the car senses, color management, creating different looks, fixing problems, how to balance proper your footage, shots merging, dealing with the small budget camera, everything you need to know from diving to resolve. Masterclass has deep explanations. If you really struggle with way of creating look, Director Kim never seen enough till he made the 26 lats which is has look DNA and skin tone lat and color separations. DCTR power grade also available. Director Kim really wants to shift you into next level. Have a permanent mentor who can guide you well to your journey of color grading. He decided to create a WhatsApp group for his own student member. But remember, to join a WhatsApp group, you need to buy one of his products, either masterclass or loot package. Now, let's back into the lesson. Okay, as you can as you can see to my shop leg the my loot pocket it has a 60 loot one of a skin tone another part is a look dna so if you have a problem creating skin tone you can just uh buy my loot package if you have problem to create a look like the way i do here you can just buy my uh, my look dna which is you just take a one package and you get everything and the very cheapest price uh, but if you want to learn more how to create look like this, you can just uh, get my masterclass. Phase one and phase two is very massive tutorials, which is can lead you perfect to know better way using my loot or creating your own. And also, if you buy those, you have accessibility to join my WhatsApp group. Okay, now uh, what I'm about to do is first I'm going to use my shadow from my HDR to to clean the black to the shadow so i want something very lighty in here so i'm going to put it around here you see before and after i clean up the shadow and here is where i'm coming to my 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 rgb mixer 
I put the red until I, I start to see the pictures getting cool. The reason why I'm doing this is just I want to fill the background. I'm not stressed. I'm not. I'm not stressed with um with my skin tone because I do period and I do serial in the period, so the skin tone is going to be catch perfectly without it being affected with a not before the. So yeah. So even I'm going to cool this. You know, going to be stressed to me. You see. And I'm coming here, coming to my my shadow, push it to the uh I mean push it to the cool pot and coming to my gain, push it to the warm part so that I have a split between my background and my subject. Look how far now are they go. Look how far look how the fill of background is there and look how skin tone is still getting there so when i qualify the skin and push it the skin itself you're going to see it's really really getting forward so now i'm going to select the skin tone like this so and qualify it and push the skin tone itself so you're going to see the splitting between the background and forehead all right so yeah and this is what my loot packet does it does itself automatically between the skin tone and subject and background yeah it does it it does it so without me using this way it do it itself so yeah all right so i'm going to select perfectly the skin tone and another thing that's helped me to get the perfect thing here is this the answer is, is splitting just lastly but it's giving me nice nice test to the output mm -hmm. Alright, so here they go. What I'm about to do now to the skin tones, my recent tutorial I've been explaining about creating skin tones. So what I'm going to do now is just I'm going to I'm going to pull my first I'm going to check to my vetoscope. I pull my blue channel from the gamma until I start to see the skin tone is getting ye yellow and then I'm pulling down my green ch channel to the gamma until i start to see the picture is getting a little bit orange or red tone if you see careful and then i'm going to reduce the saturation because it's over saturated so i'm going to reduce somewhere around here and then i'm going to pull down the luminous channel to bold out this picture the so that's the color that i i i i just modify to the skin you can see it's blending it's like i'm blending the skin to be there and then i'm going to my curve pull it a little bit to make it brighter so now you can see how different it will be from my background and my subjects look how far will they go here this is before this is after look how clean it look and how split it, it looks so you see everything everything except in my skin tone is cool you can see and this is what i done the magic we know the finish oh <laughs> we know the finish this is just our beginning all right so we already cleared a look dna this is a look dna you know and we started with the color correcting we come with the look dna and then we're going to use our picture but be before me finish oh, i'm going to increase oh, no no not this one i'm going to play around with my shadow again so i want something open like this you see yeah okay so now what we're about to do is just use the picture so let me check out yeah it's just making you know this is music video so it has to be a little bit light all right so now we are created already we created uh look dna so let's see before and after how far we it go this is before this is after this is before was like this after is like this it's beautiful so now we're going to use our picture so the way i see to use this picture i come in here select uh, once again uh um, I, I i just qualify the skin tone again like this like this
and what I'm about to do now is just um, having a super super splitting from the background so yeah this is what I'm about to do but another thing that I want to do to the contrast here I want to a little bit contrast my here my my look this part to blend this all right so here what i'm about to do is pulling my picture into cool pots just let's see how it splits in my background look it's make more cool this is what i wanted from scratch the thing that i want to be all right so another thing to the skin tone i'm going to uh to smooth the skin like this oh and i don't want the over saturated skin tone so i'm coming to the u versus saturation u versus saturation and reduce a little bit of our skin tone and this is how it's perfect our image look look how magic it does look at before look at after look how it's before was rush it was not clean it was very annoying <laughs> it was not standing you know but now it's standing at the nice top top you see it's standing at the nice level and this is how i just juice there's a more you can do there's more you can do but yeah uh, one thing that I've done is, is selecting the background selecting for this so I have to make sure I don't select this part so I I do I'll delete it next next time. Thanks very much for watching this video. I hope you really get to know how to create look uh, from scratch. And now you can just do your 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 practice and make sure it's a work out. Uh it's not like what I've done, you have to follow this step. Like I touched this today, uh maybe uh two or three points and you're going to copy the same no you have to check it out your footage what it wants uh the place that i apply the answer you can apply uh car space transformation and actually it's working the same it working the same and if you want the prints uh film prints you can just use the um, uh codec 2033 so you can just do a car space put this in your film and then you apply your loots i mean you apply the, the david's loots and then you do this you follow the step that i have done so this is dr kim hope you really subscribe my youtube channel see you guys on next tutorial ciao